Okay, good morning. Good morning. Uh, what's your name? Lutz Baptista from Waterade, India. Okay. And uh, so Lutz, why, why are you here? Uh, I've heard about the Stockholm World Water Week. Mm -hmm. I just joined Waterade last year uh -huh. and was quite keen on coming to attend to get some more knowledge and information and interact with the different types of people who come here to understand what's happening across the world. Mm -hmm. In Waterade, we do get a lot of information and knowledge about the countries in which we are working and the various types of interventions that are getting developed. But here you get to meet also other partners and stakeholders with their own experiments and understanding. Uh, but what's important is that you get a very good global understanding mm -hmm. of water sanitation and hygiene mm -hmm. and the type of uh, uh, energy that is getting sort of generated in being able to look at global solutions. Mm -hmm know but making them locally available okay. and the type of uh, possibilities that different organizations are working on mm -hmm. the type of networks that are getting developed in relation to issues on water sanitation and hygiene and I think now we're moving into the next movement of rights and trying to sort of make sure that rights become something that is meaningful and exercisable that's what's happening in Water at India. Could you just expand on what's happening there? Yeah, it's, it's also happening. I mean, we, there's a session in the afternoon today mm -hmm. talking about the human right to water. Mm -hmm. So there's a lot of thinking going on. Right. About it. And I think that's something we need to sort of take forward, mm -hmm. especially in a large country like India, mm -hmm. where the problems are quite big, both urban and rural. And we have such a complex reality in which we exist. Mm -hmm. And what rate India itself is going through certain change? Uh, we've just come out with our global strategy. Yeah. And uh, now, based on the global strategy, each country is working on its own country strategy. Mm -hmm. And uh, we've just finished. And uh, we, are, we are looking at the experience that we've gained over the last 17, 18 years in India. We've already moved quite a lot in the last uh, three country strategies that we have worked on. But now we're getting a little more into a clearer way forward. Mm -hmm. in the sense that we are now looking at uh, working more closely with the government, building their capacities to be able to deliver, making people conscious of the fact that water for them is a right mm -hmm. and that they can access safe drinking water and sanitation, but participating in the processes, not waiting for somebody else to come and do it for them. Okay. And finally also to look at the various policies that the government has mm -hmm. and we, as you must be knowing that India has a number of policies on water and sanitation right. uh, to make those policies more effective okay. and you know ground them into the type of operationalizing processes in the states. Mm -hmm. So that's the three sort of uh, uh, aims that we're going to be working on quite seriously in the next five years. So it's going to take five years to complete the process you think? You know, we, already, we are already in it. Mm -hmm. It's already in the last two years we have developed a lot of good rapport with the government and have developed some good models on the field where communities uh, communities are taking the lead in managing their water resources. Mm -hmm. But now that needs to be sort of more structured and put into some sort of a framework which becomes sort of uh, deliverable. Okay. Yeah, so that's what we are working on. And we've, uh, we've got some good experiments which we'll take forward now and look at them across the, uh, across the country, especially the 10 states that we are working in. And uh, in India, we've also set up uh, an organization called Jal Seva Charitable mm -hmm. Foundation, which is like the Indian Indian entity of water aid, mm -hmm. though it will have its own uniqueness and, mm -hmm. and space in the country. So that will give us uh, further possibilities of being able to engage with government and civil society organizations. Thank you, Lut. Great. Thanks a lot.